I was involved from the initial um, planning of the Games Night through the Parental Engagement Committee. So at our first meeting we discussed what we wanted to achieve throughout the year and we brought up the idea of doing a Games Night. And then from there my main role was to speak to my department about what games we deliver. Um, and then I was involved in making up posters um, to catch the eyes of students to get them encouraged to go. The buzz of the night would carry on, so it wasn't just a one-off thing. They could take the goodie bags home when they had crosswords and sudokus in. So it was still linked to things they were learning in school, but it was fun and it was still games like. So the goodie bags had like small puzzle games, so sudokus, crosswords, and it had pencils and rubbers, so it meant that there wasn't really any barriers to completing the games at home. For me as a teacher, the main benefit was getting to work with people across the school in different departments and getting to communicate with people that I maybe wouldn't have met otherwise. But I think in terms of the parental engagement aspect, the biggest benefit was that I got to meet parents and parents could ask kind of informal questions and get to know you a bit more and build up a rapport with some of their teachers that they might not otherwise have had. I think the parents were excited because it was something different. I think sometimes in schools events are quite formal and parents are coming in and they're maybe spoken at or they're not given much time to ask questions. But I think this they could come and have fun. Um, and then a kind of side of that was that they got to ask questions and speak to their pupils' teachers. There, one potential barrier is that um, we've got quite a large EAL population in the school so it was about finding a way to communicate with um, different families in different ways but I think the way everything was set out it was well planned and pupils know what departments had what games and there was um, senior pupils explaining each of the games which meant that the communication barrier was overcome. There was a bit of a buzz about it I think the pupils were excited to be there and people were enjoying it and having fun and I think having things like the food and having fun games at the side that weren't necessarily educational made it more of a, a night out for families so it was to do with the school, it was to do with education but it was also a fun event for them. One thing we could do maybe next time is increase the pupils that were able to come so we mainly focused on first years and some second years but I think it would be good to have pupils from across the BGE invited. I'd say, first of all, definitely get involved. As a young teacher, I think it's benefited me hugely. I think I've learned a lot from more experienced teachers. And I think advice-wise for the committee would be get pupils involved because they're the ones that are going to get their parents coming and getting their parents engaged. So take on their opinions and what they think would make a night good or an event good. I think it was just how busy it was that it was such a good turnout and that people were actually enjoying it. It was There was such a nice atmosphere in the room and... Um, to see pupils working with their families and their friends and also their teachers, it was just, it was nice. It's probably made me more confident, especially in, I've using like when I was coming up with the posters, I've increased my use of ICT. Also just having the confidence to go and speak to other teachers and other partners and parents, it's been good for me.